What's up everybody? Welcome to Horror Reviews. I'm about to watch the final trailer for Alien Romulus. This was a request by someone who is a frequenter of my videos. Now, in all honesty, I probably wouldn't watch this trailer because I already felt like the last one showed a lot. And I typically, I used to anyway, try to avoid watching too many trailers. But because of this channel and because it's requested, I will watch this. So uh, thank you for requesting it. I appreciate that you guys want to request and for me to watch these videos. I really appreciate that. Also, if you are a frequenter of my channel, please stay tuned to the very end after I watch this trailer because I have a couple of questions for you just about the way that I make these videos. So I appreciate some feedback. Enough said now, let's get into the final trailer for Alien Romulus. Are you sure you want to do this? More world building. There she is. You want to break in and steal highly regulated equipment. Okay. It's going to be our only ticket out of here. Getting a little more of the story. Should be in and out in 30 minutes. Welcome to the Romulus Space Station. Place gives me the creeps. What the hell is this? I don't know. The fuck was that? I'm not playing around, there's something in the water. What do you mean there's something in the water? I don't know, there's just something in the fucking water. Go, go. Run. Oh, that's cool. That's that's cool. No more, no more. I don't know what to do. That is gonna look gnarly. Hopefully, can we actually see it? Whatever comes, we'll face it together. Let's go. Spirit IMAX August it, man it's coming up pretty soon so that looks good still it looks a I mean there's a little more about the story going on but like they showed a lot of the same shots I do still feel like they're showing a lot of the movie kind of like I'd felt before but I I guess I like that they told us a little bit more about the story that's going on now this trailer specifically makes it feel a little bit more like aliens to me it looks like it's a little more like action heavy and a little more like intense with just like action and escaping and less with the like suspenseful horror building like the original alien which the first trailer i saw did feel like it was kind of like a middle of the middle of the two movies a merging of them i guess and then this one feels a little more like aliens it feels a little more actiony i still like the way it's shot i like the way it looks it definitely does look like more like new age horror with lots of different colors and lights and stuff like that. Yeah, it does look like, you know, digital and it, but I mean, it looks cool. It does look cool. I like the way it's shot. I love the music is still dope. Um, I'm glad we got, I am glad we got a little bit more of the characters talking and a little bit more of the feel of them interacting 
which I do appreciate because then it, it makes me feel a little bit more like, okay, this feels like the movie we're going to get. The first one's kind of like it's so choppy and there's not a lot of dialogue. So it doesn't feel like you really have characters to gravitate towards. So I do actually feel like, okay, we're going to be following these characters. I know a little bit more about them, a little bit more about their journey and their objective, which is pretty cool. Um, I mean, it does look, it looks awesome. So got a little bit more Xenomorph stuff in there, which again, it's like, it looks cool, but I'm trying to like, not like I'm trying, I'm hoping I don't, it's not just showing us so much that chest bursting scene. It was awesome. I liked how she was scanning her back, but then I was like, I was like, I'm watching it and I'm kind of like, yeah, I want to see it. This looks cool. But I'm also like, don't show me, don't show me, don't show me at the same time. I'm actually thinking like, don't show me it. Don't show me it. I don't want to see it. I want to wait for the movie. So that's kind of like I'm torn between two things. I want to see it. I think it looks cool, but I'm also like trying not to watch too much stuff because I don't want it to be ruined for the movie. So I don't know. That being said, it's, honestly, I don't, I feel like it adds that much more though. So that's good. I, I mean, again, it already kind of showed a lot. So I do feel like it shows a lot, but not so much more that I'm like, whoa, that's like a whole different movie. Anyway, so thanks for watching, everybody. I appreciate it. If you're like a frequenter of this channel, real quick, I just wanted some feedback from you. I appreciate a few minutes of your time. So I've gotten like a few comments and things like that here and there with my reaction specifically. And like, you know, do it this way, do it that way. Talk more, talk less. You don't talk enough. What are you doing? So I just wanted some real quick feedback for how my, like the cutout of my head looks on this video. I'm going to specifically make it a little bit smaller on this video. What do you guys think about that? Or do you prefer when my head's a little bigger? Like how important is the reaction part of it? You know, if I'm not, especially if I don't pause it, sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. But like how important is seeing my face? I'm not going to control whether I talk during the trailer or not. Because like that's more of like a real authentic reaction. If I feel like I want to pause it and talk about it, I'm going to do that. If I don't feel like I'm going to pause it and talk about it, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to like cater that necessarily towards the viewers. But I do want to make these as entertaining and enjoyable as possible. So like where like would you would you guys like it better if I went back to how I showed the whole trailer and like I just put the trailer cut out on the video of my face so you can see the whole trailer but it's smaller or do you like the little circle cut out of my head but maybe make it smaller put it more in the corner let me know what you guys think just some like options some feedback um what do you guys think about just the way it looks and the way it's cut together thanks for watching everybody thank you for your feedback let me know in the comments i really appreciate you guys checking this out i don't want to scared on a big bad wolf i never see the silver line and only see the gold i don't speak in caps dog everything bold and i put that on myself because it's a life that i done chose i said come through you can see me on the west side now it's funny how they walking with each other